Hey everyone, today I'm going to bring this Emron SM5C. This is RGB LED strip uh, from Aperture and uh, it's been laying in my uh, studio since like more than 10 days. First of all, thanks to BNW Collection, they sent me this. I am not liable to say anything good about it if it's not. So I thought why not just, and they never wanted me to make a review about it. So I'm going to put it somewhere in my studio as you have seen from my uh, backdrop that I love RGB lights. I love RGB lights, lights a lot. And I think I have something in my mind that where I'm going to install it. By the way, if you haven't visited BNW Collections, it's an online store in Pakistan which sells photography and videography equipment. It's a very good store. It's very competitive and very legit. Do check out their website. I'm going to link everything in description. So let's first unbox uh, uh, this thing. And uh, what I'm going to do, I will. Uh, I have no idea how this thing works, but I'm already using Aperture lights, this is the key light, this is the fill light, both are from Aperture and then I have those bulbs from Aperture, then MC4 uh, from Aperture. So everything is pretty much connected on, on my app. So this thing also works with app. This is all I know. And uh, you can put different colors in uh, on every LED in this thing. So what I'm going to do that I'm going to um, take it out from the box and uh, then I will um, pair it with my app. We will see different functions and if I decide in between this video that where I'm going to install it I will do it in front of you guys and we will see the result so let's start the unboxing so here is the light itself very much like any other LED light strip package it's all wrapped around and I have no idea how long it is we are going to find out in this package some paperwork maybe I'll need this guide a little bit and um, some silica and double side tape which is good usually the tape behind this led strip don't work very good or maybe you need some extra so they have included a whole lot in the package very thoughtful then alcohol swabs and uh, some cloth you will need it uh, when you are going to put it on some surface you have to clean that surface with this alcohol swabs okay this is some remote this must be very necessary for it and then this is the power hub so this is all what we get in the box so what i'm going to do right now i will plug everything in extension um, cord and we will power it on right here we will pair it with our app and we will play around with this led strip let's do it okay i have just plugged in everything and uh, one thing i want to tell you about this slide that uh, this the name carries everything sm5c means SM means smart capabilities and 5 is 5 meter and C is the color, right? Every single pixel you can see on the box that every single pixel can uh, have a different color. And second thing is you can see uh, the top layer of this uh, LED is it's very diffused. It's uh, wide. So the light is going to spread beautifully and you cannot cut it in the middle like you do with other LED strips. If you are going to cut it, it's not going to work. So you have to use the whole lot, all 5 meter long. Uh, LED and the other thing is uh, that one side you are going to attach with your remote and and remote is a hub uh, between your power brick and uh, uh, this LED the power comes into this um, remote and this remote is going to transfer uh, power to LED strip now come to the remote remote have this jog dial I'm sure that it's going to um, change the brightness of this light we will see it later on and there is a, a button of on, on and off and then Wi-Fi then a second button is of um, some music and Bluetooth. And uh, the third one is CCT, HI, HSL and uh, uh, FX. You can switch between all of these functions. And there is also a very small microphone hole, uh, which, uh, which will work with some music, I guess. The light is going to change with the music beat. So this thing is going to listen to the music and it will send the signal to the light and with their, whatever is the programming inside it, this brain. And yes, another thing, on the other end of this light, you have another connector which you are going to use with another light. If you have another strip of this LED, you can extend it uh, more further to extend the length of your light. If you are using it on the ceiling of your room, then you must need the longer length. You can keep joining more lights so get the whole area covered. So the moment of truth, let's push it in. Okay, now we will press this. Oh, <laughs> okay, hello. Hello, this is Amron SM5C. Okay, it's catching my uh, voice and it's playing some random colors. 
with this. I don't know how it's working. So now we have some CCT. These are the HSL. Okay, this is, a, you, I'm controlling the brightness and with this jog dial. And this is some, some built-in effect, I guess. All these lights are having different colors, like blue, green, blue, green, and it's like running, if you can see in spiral. Okay, then this is the CCT. This is the lowest and this is the brightest. Then this is the HSL. Very nice. Okay, now I got it. We can press this button as well, this jog dial. And in HSL, if I'm going to press it once, it will work as a brightness jog dial. And if I'm going to press it again, it will let us choose the HSL value. It's very bright light and it's very bright. I like this color, the white. Blue is beautiful. This purple, pink, this red. Wow, beautiful color. Okay, then in FX, same we are doing in FX, we are going to try uh, first the brightness and then when I press it, okay, it's giving us a whole lot of different options. Wow, <laughs> this is beautiful. Wow, I like it. Okay, I'm just turning it a little bit just to have every different option. Nice. It's just, it's just spreading one hue at a time all over till the end and then the new color start running from one end to the other. Wow, this thing is beautiful. Okay, as I have told you in the beginning that you can uh, put different colors in every pixel. I'm not sure about how many pixels are there in like uh, one go in different slots. Um, I have no idea, but um, I, I found this thing in the app of uh, Cytus Link that how you can put different colors in uh, all over the LED, not just one color. Okay, in, here you have this, you, you keep scrolling to the bottom and there is pixel control, select pixel control. And uh, here you have, there are like five pixels total, I guess uh, three by the 15 every meter okay now I understand it one pixel is of one meter you can see that one meter light is having a, a yellow color and other is having blue color okay so we have a five meter light we can uh, give five different colors all over the length of this light the first one is um, um, hue uh, 36 second is hue 199 the opposite of spectrum and uh, the third one I'm going to give is HSL like green. Okay, you see now? And uh, the fourth one is the opposite of the green and that's some purple, I guess, yes. And the fifth one is going to be my favorite and that's teal. Let's make teal. Okay. Okay, now you can see that every pixel is of one meter and we total have five meter length. So every single color is spread over to one meter length. Okay, one meter is around like three feet. Okay, three feet of yellow, three feet of this blue and three feet of this uh, purple and three feet of this <laughs> teal. I forgot the name of the color. <laughs> So here it is. This is this is the idea behind it that uh, I was having that where, uh, wherever I'm going to put this light, I will put it in two or three different colors. So I'm really very happy with this. You have seen it. So the f one thing is this, you control the pixels by yourself and then pix there is a function of pixel effects. I'm more focusing on these features because this is the new thing. Every other thing is same as other lights, but this thing is pretty new. So now I'm going to jump to pixel effects. First, let me play rainbow. Wow, I can speed it up. You can see that how beautiful it is. Oh, wow. I can reduce the speed of this transition. It's going to move slowly, very slowly. And uh, it will take like 50 millicentimeter per second, the movement, and then 630 centimeter per second. This is the fastest one. 
these type of effects is very good for like gamers or some TikToker sort of thing and uh, people who are like very funky. So they have option for everybody. I can say there are hundreds of different options and uh, features you can um, use on these lights. So you have seen everything you have seen today's uh, review, unboxing, or you can say uh, how to video. It's a mixed sort of video. So if you like this video, consider subscribing if you haven't already and smash the thumbs up button for YouTube algorithm. So this is it for today. See you in the next one. Till then, peace.